Spokane voters are being asked to chime in after the February special election. The Spokane Public School District wants feedback on its failed bond. The district asked voters for $200 million for rebuilding two schools and making updates to others. For News Now's Allison Martinez in studio with how you can have your voice heard about it. Right now, Spokane Public Schools has an anonymous survey open to the community. The school board is considering getting another vote out. Two options being discussed are the November 2024 election or February 2027. In the meantime, the district wants to hear thoughts on its bond from district employees, parents and voters. We want to hear not only from our families and our students and our staff, but it's also you know, critical that we're listening to those uh, that live in our school district that don't have kids in our school system or maybe have recently moved here and are retired. Uh, collectively, the community, uh, we belong uh, to them. The survey has been out for a few days now. Superintendent Swinyard says many of the responses have had one consistent theme. What we've seen in the initial survey results is that it validates that assumption that uh, inflation and assessed value on people's tax bill was a significant influence on how they voted. Results from this survey will be shared with the school board and then discussed at their meeting on March 20th. From there, the board will use their findings to decide on next steps. The Spokane Public Schools survey is open until this Wednesday, March, thir March 13th. For more information on how you can participate, you can visit our website, kxly.com. Reporting in studio, Allison Martinez for News Now.